Okay guys, welcome back. I just got off work a little while ago and I am ready to play some more Doom. At least I think I am. I might be kind of off because I'm tired. <laughs> tired today! But uh, let's see how this goes. I've got my overhead light on right now because it was a little bit dark on the last one. I mean, I think you could still see everything, but... Yeah, I just don't like the weird shadows that it casts on my face, so yeah, we'll s hopefully I'll be okay. So let's get started. It's recording. Why do I always get the feeling that something's going to go terribly wrong? Because it usually does. It's okay. We're, it's don't, it's no bad luck, no bad luck, no bad luck. It'll be good. It'll be okay. Load the game. So, Alpha Lab Sector 2, Union Aerospace Science Division. So this is what, the fourth, no, the fifth level now? I think it's the fifth level. So let's see what wonderful prizes and Amazing things await us. Here at the USC, we make Ew. Uh, someone forgot to turn off the garbage compactor. Not sure what that guy's problem was. So the garbage disposal seems to be malfunctioning and spitting out. Oh, it's got Okay, what's happening? How did I get over there? That was jarring. Maybe turn the volume down on my headset. This is too loud. Can't hear myself. <clears throat> Not that I need to hear myself, but... <clears throat> it's harder for me to talk when I can't hear myself. Shotgun! See what's in these wonderful little corners over here. <clears throat> so I ah! did, did you see my dude guy? He just like hopped. He like hopped before I pushed jump. It was just oh, I remember this part. I think. Let's nice try. Um, again with the darkness. Hey, Pudgy. Your intestines are showing. Not really. I hate these things. Gotcha. <coughs> I think I was remembering the very first, one of the first levels or whatever, when he like looks in the mirror and he just like goes bonkers. <laughs> that was kind of funny. Urinals. Oh, this is sad. The John got tipped over. So I get. Hello, is this reaching anyone? Hi, I'm yeah. I'm broadcasting on a very low frequency. You. If you can hear me, I'm not far. Please help me. How do you know you're I'm myself in storage room C4. Please, C4. If can that's. Me, please help me. That doesn't sound like a good idea to lock yourself inside C4. Um, so how did he know that I was near or not? Is it just based on the radius of the. the his radius. Uh, frequency that he's sending out. He just knows that I must be close if I can hear it. I think that's kind of making some pretty big assumptions there. Ugh, my allergies. It's terrible. My allergies are more scary than this game is. <clears throat> he 
skill. Munchy munch. You know, I don't. You're not even a zombie. Why are you eating him? That's just. Ugh. I'm so disappointed. Hey, what? Still have my flashlight. I think I. Okay. I need to relearn how to dodge because I always just kind of dodge right and then left and right and then left and a lot of times I just end up running right into the fireball of death so I guess I need to re relearn. Forget everything you learned about how to play FPS games and try to be a little bit more interesting. Ah! It, it like licked me or something that's nasty. I feel violated. This guy's just still sitting there ha enjoying his lunch. Hey, get off him. Oh, this guy's still alive. Ew, that's gross. That's gross. He was just letting him eat him. That's nasty. And you kind of wonder what he was really doing. <clears throat> Mind in the gutter. I got my water bottle right in front of my uh, hood. Okay. No camera activated. Okay, so this is a security checkpoint. Junction, this is me. Hey, say, say hello. Hi. Oh, I can't see myself saying hi because whenever I turn around, it's, my back is showing again. How confusing. MFS compressor, <coughs> excuse me. Storage and engineering, engineering coolant control. <clears throat> I'm not seeing anything interesting. I was hoping I was going to see like some crazy monster. So should I go down in the floor? I don't know which, which is the main. Are you following me? Where are you? Okay. Oh, it's just uh, some armor which I guess I could probably use because I got owned earlier. <clears throat> Alright. Make sure there's nothing heavy in the corner. Ooh, I can see Mars from here! So. It looks like we have natural lighting outside. Why do we just like live in this darkness inside? Why don't we get some windows, you know? It's kind of, it's kind of inefficient. Like you can save a lot of electricity if you just use more natural lighting, guys. Where did you spawn? There you are. Easier to dodge when you're further away, obviously. <laughs> He's like, what the hell are you doing? It's like, I was just minding my own business and you go shooting in the back like that. That's Since so the dawn of the space age, Union Aerospace has been at the forefront of not only developing new technology, but pushing those developments to even more daring extremes. With an abundant production of hydrogen... What am I seeing in here? Hydrocon, the specialist what does this machine the do? Question, it transfers the shiny blue that fuel to make core the thingies. Of space research of the other. The answer has been a resounding yes. Sure Under the direction of Dr. Malcolm Batruga, key UAC scientists have made startling... Hey, living people! You're about to die, aren't you? Hey, guy, don't, don't delay. Go. Go find your buddies. Huh. That little grunt that never can keep up with the rest of the group. Now, fuel that would once take up half the payload of an interplanetary ship only occupies a fraction of that ship. Hey, hey, wait, 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 where are you going? Where are you going? Come back. Oh, wait, you're good. You're bad, guys. I thought you were a good guy. I'm very 
very disappointed now. Three. Bravo team reports they've located your position but are unable to move to your current location. Head to engineering and try to link up with them in sector three. See if I get any got anything interesting in the PDA. Uh, success with the MFS Audio log for Walter Connors. The MFS compressor is producing fantastic results. The latest modification I made to the dilation matrix were the real key to the recent breakthrough. All in all, I feel my work on this project has been the catalyst that propelled everything forward. I've also taken a of set amount of time each day to make sure that oh, everyone is doing their job, and of course I check all of their data to ensure that no mistakes are made. This is okay, going to be a just shut up and give me the code. The company. And quite honestly, without my input and hard work, I am not sure that we would have gotten this far. I don't care. I wanted also to thank you for your supervisory role in the project. No problem. Working with you is a true honor. Yeah, Just I know. remember me in the end of the year reports as I'm certain I deserve a promotion at Walter App. Oh, are you now? Nah, I don't think so. Dang it, I listened to all of that and you didn't even give me a damn code. Okay. Audio report regarding the disrespectful treatment of new research staff. September 14th, 2145. As you know, I have gone to considerable effort to recruit my staff researchers for Alpha. Finding team members with the qualifications, let alone the willingness to come to Mars, has not been a trivial task. You Actually, know, I didn't even need to write it down, did I? But it is necessary that I Sounds exercise right in front of it. complaints that must be taken seriously. We won't be able to do our best. No, a rat is exactly the right one. Ow! Continuing report to UAC security has been so inappropriate practice in submitting my staff to unnecessary background checks. Background checks? We be left to complete our assignments without further delay. If there is some kind of security, I will be with you. Ow! This is Andrew Chin. damn code either. Next. Flipshits. <laughs> Play. Oh wait. I should really read. Audio log for so Jack Smith, uh, benefits analyst in HR 1024-2145. I just went through another batch of accident reports from the science team. We've had five more people hurt this week while working with the equipment. The most serious incident was when John Hughes, his hand was caught in one of the plastic extrusion systems. He was performing maintenance on the plane. He he unplugged it and had the safety of the plane in his pocket. He activated it with a pair of power stones. He's been reported that the machine is The cost on that engine alone is a flag, but this is one in a pile. Guys, I'm trying to listen to this audio log and you're just interrupting me. Well, because uh, according to these reports, the equipment's breaking down on a daily basis. Please mark this for review at corporate end of log. Corporate doesn't give a shit. Trust me, I know. You through here. Oh, I'm all out. Safe. Come on, I can't wait. You're gonna die. You're probably gonna die. You can go first. Electromagnetic pulses have knocked oh, out the electrical idea. system for this safe. area. Watch out, a big one could knock out our lights. Yeah, you just keep walking in front of me where it's safe. Flashlight went out too, that's not fair. What was that? It was me. I farted. Stay 
close. Hey, look out! See, I took that burning fireball from hell for you. You, you, you ought to be grateful. I hope you're grateful. I hope you give me like a big fat health pack or something at the end of this. Or something better. Give me give me a full you know, mother load of shotgun shots. Don't let it get me. I think you I think you got him. Thank God, oh, God he's dead. Thank God you ducked. <laughs> that was pretty good, man. Like for a scientist. That was a pretty good uh dodge. Hurry up. We can't stop. Another. Another what? Let me reload. Kill him! Dodge him again. I don't think I don't think this guy is who he says he is. I think he's a soldier. He's a super soldier. A ninja! <laughs> It wasn't going to get you, it was, it was totally, like, feasting on my face. There's the exit. You're going to die, you're going to die, I can tell. Yeah. Sorry, dude, sorry, dude. That could have gone much worse, I suppose. It could have gone better, but... I'm sorry, dude, I let you down, but... You're probably not really dead, because obviously you were, like, total ninja, so you probably totally dodged that death blow, now you're just playing dead, right? Yeah, that's, that's what I figured. gotten any of these damn things. Let me see. Still haven't gotten any new codes. Probably just video discs, user email. It's just my regular stuff, I think. door was the main main path but it is probably is it sounds like a cockroach ah! you know give me demons give me monsters anything but cockroaches those things are terrifying cockroach oh my god Oh my god. Where's the cockroach? Yeah. No, it's a spider. Okay, well spiders aren't that terrible. All of those are kind of ugly. I hate the the flesh colored spiders. Those are really gross. I saw a huge one in Japan. Like, I was um, buying groceries at the grocery store. And then suddenly, I was at the, you know, the register paying for my stuff, and then suddenly there was this giant spider crawling by the cashier. And he apparently was just like, oh, because he just kind of like brushed it aside. Oh, get away from me, goddammit. Oh my god. 
shit! kind of what that spider I saw in Japan looked like. Except obviously it was a little bit smaller. Just a little bit. Oh, is this the end? Yay! We won again! I think that went faster than some of the other maps. But I almost died. I almost died. You know, it makes me kind of wonder if... makes me kind of wonder if uh, <laughs> I would have managed to beat the game. Because, you know... I die a lot, usually. So that's for that's good for that episode. I will see you guys later. Bye.